Tampa's police chief is reminding the community violence will not be tolerated. Chief Brian Dugan says his officers were ambushed after responding to a call over the weekend. ABC Action News reporter Julie Salomone with the new video tonight. We're here. Any other units over here? Tampa police received a call about shots fired early Saturday morning around 1 a.m. When officers arrived, they found a large crowd and did not locate a victim. Helicopter video shows the scene on North 15th Street and East 26th Avenue. It's an ambush. I have no other way to describe it. Uh, when there's that many people out there and clearly no one had been shot, it was just a setup to get the cops there. Police Chief Brian Dugan says the crowd became aggressive, throwing bottles and glass, jumping on police cars. We ended up actually calling every single police officer that was available that night to respond there, from New Tampa to South Tampa. The police chief says two police officers were injured during this call, but they're expected to be okay. They were both hit in the head with glass bottles. Then early Monday morning, a Tampa police officer was injured after arriving at a gas station on Hillsborough Avenue and Nebraska Avenue regarding a call about someone stealing from the store. When the officer tried to take the suspect into custody, police say the suspect tried to take the officer's gun and struck the officer in the face. We're going to use the necessary force to take people into custody, and I think that's what people need to understand. Chief Dugan says violence against law enforcement will not be tolerated. The the police, we always have everyone's back. Nobody has ours right now. And that's what I think is missing here. Reporting in Tampa, Julie Salmon, ABC Action News.